Good evening, I just thought I'd post a quick video um, in the shed on a week night and it's bloody freezing. Um, and I'm just trying to make something for the Airstream and <clears throat> the front window of Airstreams is a flat piece of glass that um, I think a lot of rocks kick up and um, risk shattering it. And it took me a long time to replace the um, glass uh, originally on on the airstream so what I've what you can buy is a Lex and rock guard and they're about between 350 and 400 dollars in the, uh, to get them from the States US uh, so it's probably by the time shipping um, it would probably cost about 750 bucks Australian so I'm trying to improvise and make my own I've gone down to uh, the big green shop and I've got this aluminium angle if you can sort of see I actually think it's designed for um, floating floor edges of floating floors and just cutting that up into pieces and I've got a piano hinge and I've also got this um, polycarbonate roofing piece uh, if you can have a look it's sort of like laser light but it's quite um, it's got really small panels so what I'm hoping to do is make a frame out of the aluminium and use this a hinge and some tie downs to make an actual uh, guard for the front window probably for about 50 Australian dollars uh, not 750 US dollars so that's the plan we'll see how we go here's a quick update making the screen at the front as you can see I've got three out of the four I've cut the clancy glass to size using a um, jigsaw and got all my sides in place just got one more to put in and then we'll um, rivet the corners. So I see there's a bit of overlap there, so we'll just rivet those to give it a bit of an airstream look and hopefully it'll be done. So just to show you where I'm up to, I've put three rivets in each corner. They're sort of, they're quite big rivets. They go all the way through. And I'm reusing the piano hinge from inside the kitchen actually. So I use that on the window. I've just got to rivet it in place now. Okay, I just wanted to show you the finished product. Um, as you can see, it's in place and looking pretty good. I've got a couple of latches here holding it down for when you're on the road and um, they come off quite easily and it just hinges up nicely. Um, you can see the piano hinge there that I've reused and just probably need to get a gas strut or two to hold it up when parked. But yeah, overall I'm um, Really happy with how that turned out. Certainly a lot cheaper than importing one from the States. Probably only cost me about, oh, probably about $60, $70 in the end. 